Hey, what's up guys? Steven of Salonga here, and today I've got a hair cutting tutorial for you guys and a styling tutorial. I've gotten loads of requests for this uh, football player from the National Portugal team. Um, this is Miguel Veloso, and uh, I'm ready to go, so let's get started. All right guys, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start with a number, I'd say number two, or this is a nine millimeter guard here, and I'm gonna buzz this all up to about probably right here throughout the sides and the back. All right, now I'm gonna to switch to a number uh, three guard, which is gonna allow me to go a little bit longer, and I'm gonna bring it up probably to about right into here, all the way to the sides, as well as the back. All right, now that the sides and the back are done, I'm gonna do scissor over comb technique, which is basically gonna blend the shorter hair into the longer hair on top, and I'm gonna do that just by working up through the head shape and rounding it off uh, right into the corners here. I'm gonna to continue to do this on both sides, and basically I'm cutting this to where it's blending in to the top, where the top is about, I'd say, an inch and a half in length. All right, now I'm gonna cut the top area to where it's about, I'd say, again, an inch or so on the top of the head. And how I'm gonna do that is I'm gonna connect this going from shorter to longer, and I'm gonna cut towards the face. And what this is doing, it's allowing me to blend this back area here in through the top. So let's continue to do this, working towards the front of the face. Then after you have that done, you can then come in and cut the top of the head to where, again, it's about an inch to an inch and a half, working into the top is about right here in the front, about two and a half to three inches long here, because we want to have this a little bit longer through the front. So we do that by basically combing a section straight up, and then we're going to slightly pull back and over direct to the back section, or the previous section we just cut, which is going to create a shorter to longer. So when you over direct and you pull back towards you, that's when you're going to leave that front part longer because you're pulling it back towards you and it'll fall a little bit longer in the front. So let's finish this up in the front here, and then when we're done, I'll do some texturizing, I'll be ready to style it. All right, so now I'm just gonna texturize it, I'm gonna point cut into the whole thing like this uh, throughout the whole top of the head, which is gonna add a little bit of texture, and then when I'm done doing that, I'm gonna style it with uh, a dry styling paste. All right, so now, now I'm just gonna turn the head around as you can see here, uh, we've got the look, there's the look on top, and it kind of blends and fades in from, uh, again, probably a number two or so into number three, and then combing it, cutting it by hand, working towards the top an inch to an inch and a half to probably about two and a half to three inches the most right in the front here, okay? And again, you can style it however you want, uh, but he's got his kind of going over this way, uh, and I think it's a really, really cool style. So uh, I hope you guys really enjoyed this. All right, guys, well, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I love all the comments. Please like the video if you do like it. Uh, share it and thank you so much for watching. So stay tuned for more tutorials with the Salon Guy.